one of the nominees for Coach of the Year as well. How will she get on? We'll let you know about that. At the end of the competition, as China take on Thailand here in the men's 58, Uri Dong from China against Ramarong Sawek Wiri. It's a big name in Taekwondo. Can he live up to that big reputation? Uri Dong, 1m78, fourth place in the Grandstand qualifiers. Ramarong Sawek Wiri, a couple of times bronze medal at the World Championships, a silver in the Grand Prix as Marcelo Vinicius Costas Resenda. Our Brazilian centre referee in charge of proceedings in this one. Wiri Dong in blue of course, Sawek Wiri, the man in red. Are both coaches by way of Pung Seng High School in Korea. It's going to come out on top in the coach off, but the battle in the centre evident. Wuri Dong comes in as a qualifier, and as we've seen, the fresh fighters from Korea falling foul of the Chinese yet again. That front leg picks up nicely. Ram Narong, Sawek Wiri. Two points down here. Ooh, again with the back kick, leaves a space. And it is Sawek Wiri that finds it. Excellent four pointer. Wiri Dong leaves a space again. Another big spin from Sawek Wiri. Narong, Sawek Wiri, certainly not leg Wiri in this one. Looks fresh, looks ready. Chi Young Suk, the Thai coach, likewise. Of course, the Chinese fighter just coming up into this grouping. Nice little front leg counter. For more than halfway through the first round, six points shared, but the lion's share of them for Thailand. Thought up again about the spin. Almost a little bit predictable there. Walked into a little counter from Wu from China. He's done really well, has Wu Ridong. Blocking from Sawek Wuri of Thailand. The Thai fighter involved in a battle now, 20 to go. Good spin, that was fantastic. Ram Narong, Sawek Wiri, rams that one home. And quality counts in this one as we count down the last 10. Excellent stuff there from the Thai fighter in red. Takes the Gamjong gladly, five seconds to go. The referee only got eyes for Thailand. Chinese fighter Wu Dong flies across the ring, generates another gam jump. Has the man from Thailand done enough to hang on to the round? He has, not by much though. And right off the local host nation at your peril, every single one of them certainly peaking just in time for this. And of course, in terms of the periodization, the training, many fighters not coming into this on top form after their exertions at the Grand Prix final. But finding his feet just about, so Ekwiri. So just about halfway through proceedings here in this opening session. Of course, this the under 49s and 58s. The women's 57s and men's 68s will be in session number two. As we come out for round number two. In this under 58 kilogram battle. So Ekwiri with the lead. Wuri Dong certainly gave him plenty to worry about. That opening round. Good 
counter back kick just whistling past so where he shows his own ability to do likewise Good shot on the board Woody Dong certainly not worried about this just going for a scrap here the new adaptation of the rules which is about winning the round I have to say I'm a fan of it so far of course the fighters may have different opinions coaches likewise I'm sure you guys as Taekwondo fans as well but the adaptation certainly producing more entertainment is it here to stay so Wick where he flashes one home again just missing there with that head kick the Thai coach just saying forget it take the gam John move on concentrate on the task at hand and it is a mighty task because Wuri Dong is always up in your face you don't have to look far to find them so Wick Wuri looking a bit angry now tries that head kick just a whisker away from the whiskers of Wuri Dong It's been a bad tempered affair, you have to say. A bit of afters from both fighters as the Hogu comes loose. And you can guess that Wuri Dong is going to let loose in the last 40 seconds in this one. Seven points of a difference, 40 seconds in which to keep himself involved in this Wuri Dong. Going for it. Ram wrong. Sawek Wiri. Well, we know he's got the back kicks. He's also got great control of distance. Sliding in and out. There is the back kick that I mentioned. And he's back in business in this second round. Showing his power and strength. Can he secure a spot in the quarter final? Lovely head movement as well. Wuri Dong, testament to him, fighting to the finish. Can he find something in the last 10? Nice reverse turn kick round the corner. All it creates, though, is a gam jump and a two point opportunity now for Wuri Dong. Can he find it in the last 10? Back leg turn kick, just missing. Good block from Sawek Wuri. The tie fighter either too close or too far away. And he's not too far away now from the quarter finals. Cleans him out with a big reverse round the corner. worried look there looking for the cams on the other way around Team Thailand and the crowd doing a bit of refereeing as well a little conversation Cam John given good refereeing points going round the wrong way there just a bit of confusion between the referee and indeed those putting the points on the board the referee no confusion order about to be restored yep just a technical Emily Moraes there the referee just making sure scores on the board are perfect clock is ticking back leg turn and kick misses and wow Ram Rong Sawek Wiri coming into this one wouldn't have known it been so difficult Che Young Suk knows he's been in a battle as well well done to Thailand good fight from China Confirmation, Wuri Dong gave it absolutely everything he had. Ramarong Sawek Wuri, more than deserving of that excellent victory there. there top stuff for Thailand commiserations for China and we are moving on now to the under 49 kilogram matchup 